This is breaking news from Channel 7 Eyewitness News. And that breaking news unfolding in Harlem, a horrific loss for the city. A firefighter killed in the line of duty. 37-year-old Michael Davidson killed in a fire on a movie set. We just received a statement from the movie's producers. News Chapter 7 live over the fire scene right now. Several streets are shut down. Good morning. I'm Shirley Nellicott. And I'm Ken Rosado. Today is Friday, March 23rd. And here's what we know right now. 37-year-old firefighter Michael Davidson, a 15-year veteran of the department. Two more firefighters were seriously hurt. Firefighter Davidson was on the engine that was first to that fire that raged to five alarms. Those deadly flames started in the basement and quickly grew. We have live team coverage beginning with Eyewitness News reporter Derek Waller live on the scene. And Derek, we just heard from the movie producers what they have to say. Right, well, they, they gave their condolences to Davidson's family. More on that in a moment. This was uh, the scene of a movie. Now, very sadly, the scene of a fatal fire. And right now, firefighters are still here at 149th and St. Nicholas conducting their investigation. This fire started in the cellar of this building, but as you can see, it extended to every level of this apartment building. Overnight, a neighbor shot video showing the intensity of those flames. The building was occupied at the time. It's the former home of the St. Nick's Jazz Club that closed in 2011. The FDNY says flames broke out in the cellar just before 11 o'clock last night. Uh, that's an incredibly dangerous place uh, for firefighters to go in the cellar because after they entered, the flames got worse. Davidson, who was specifically tasked with fighting that fire with the nozzle on the front line, well, he was forced to the back of the building and he was missing for about nine minutes. Somehow while backing out of that building, firefighter Davidson was separated from the rest of the unit. A search ensued. Members tried desperately to find firefighter Davidson. When they did, he was unconscious. Everybody was running and um, the, the um, ambulance was coming and stuff. Like it was, cra it was crazy. Well, as we mentioned, a movie shoot was going on at the time called Motherless Brooklyn with actor director Edward Norton, who was here when the flames broke out. The producers of Motherless Brooklyn sent us a statement that reads in part, our hearts ache in solidarity with his family. New York City firefighters truly are the bravest in the world. Back out here live at 149th in St. Nicholas, I can tell you that six people total uh, suffered injuries, including two other firefighters who did sustain uh, some serious injuries. But again, the cause is still under investigation.